Hello my friends and welcome back to the channel. Today I will be showing you how to do a refill and also a design. The first thing that uh, you need to do is to remove the previous gel polish that you might have and for that I'm using a ceramic bit and this one is kind of rough so it's going to help me remove the gel polish faster. Right after that I am going to get a different bit and this one is less rough than the other one and I like to use a less rough one to work near my natural nail. It is very important that you don't damage your natural nail and sometimes when you use a bit that is too rough you can get burning sensations so that's going to prevent that. Right after that I am going to push back my cuticles. You can cut them if you want to, I just don't do it. Following up with primer, it is very very important that you apply primer on your natural nail. Now I am ready to start filling in my nails. I start with a bit right in the middle of the nail and then gently I push it back. Make sure not to touch the skin. If you do, go ahead and wipe it off. I'm going to follow the same steps except for this nail I do want it uh, thicker so I will be applying a second bit of acrylic. Notice that the second bit of acrylic, I'm applying it above the previous one. And um, I wanted to make it thicker right on top because I had filed down the nail uh, too thin. So I just want to add some thickness. Sometimes when you are doing the nails on your own, it tends to get a little difficult and um, just using filing block as a support. So again, you know, I do want to have control on my fingers and I do want my hand to be steady. Once I'm done filling in my nails, then I go back to the bit that I use for my natural nail and notice that I am using it just to soften the, um, the bottom part of the nail like so. And then I will be using a nail file just to shape off the nails one more time. I'm using the block here uh, just to make everything a smooth surface and I just go ahead and do the same thing on each one of my nails. I will be using two different colors. I will be using a white one and also a nude one. Now I will be applying two hands of the same color just so I have an even coat. So this is going to be the first coat. Then I will cure it for 60 seconds and uh, I'll do the same exact thing and again cure it for another 60 seconds. For the nail art I will be using the blooming gel and I do have a video explaining in detail how this product is used so don't forget to check it out. Once I'm done with a desired design then I will, I will cure my nails one more time for 30 seconds and then I will apply a top coat and cure it for 60 seconds. For the bling bling, I will be using uh, my Mia Secret Resin. This is such an amazing product. 
those rhinestones will not go anywhere once you use the Mia Secret resin. So practically I'm just, uh, you know, working my very own design. And once I'm done, I will be spraying in the Mia Secret activator and that will dry everything out right away. And the last step is to apply a top coat once again and uh, you will be curing it for 60 seconds and you are all done. My friends, this is the final result. I hope that you like this video and like always, I will see you on my next one. Hasta la vista. Adios.